Hello, my crafty friends. This is Teresa with Fresh and Renewed with Teresa coming to you on the Not Too Shabby channel today. I am using the Lazy Day products and I am using my brand new Ohuhu pastel markers to um, color up these images. I have used some of the Lazy Day stamps to color these up. And to or to stamp these out and then I am coloring them these up and I will leave all of the color the markers listed down below I'm showing you my markers here I will leave all the the colors that I use listed down below and um, I'm going to play some music while I color and then I'll catch you back when I am finished. I'm back and I am showing you here that I am using a Mojo Monday sketch that is a and sorry about that not being it makes three cards and it uses two sheets of paper and there's a cutting guide to cut these two sheets of paper now I know I used very busy paper patterns here but um, I'm separating everything and getting everything set for my cards and I'm going to put my cards together. Now, I like a full panel on my cards. I don't like a whole lot of white space. Here is the sketch for this card. It doesn't, when you cut the, the two pieces of paper, it you have a full panel for two of the cards, but for one card you don't. So I went ahead and used a wonky stitched rectangle die that I have out of my stash and cut this um, 
kind of orange piece of cardstock to kind of go with the color scheme of the paper and um, so it will be a background for these two pieces of paper. Now I do recognize and I will acknowledge that these are very, very different and very um, busy patterns that go together, but I just kind of wanted a kind of a almost a wild look for these cards. I'm keeping them very flat um, so I can mail them easier and um, <laughs> just used a little a stitch circle die to have a ground my images on the circle die and I let the not today on the t-shirt be the sentiment for those and I'm using my barely art liquid glue to adhere everything down today I kind of waver between that and my ATG gun but today I used all liquid glue and putting my pieces together here and I had this one go landscape instead of a portrait mode both of the other cards are portrait mode but I did have this one goes go landscape just I, I felt it it kind of my papers lended themselves for for that and I'm gonna do the not today today t-shirt again and I'm this time I'm gonna put it to the right hand side of the circle and again put everything down flat I don't need a sentiment for this card I um, put the little coffee cup down below or beside the the shirt it might those that shirt reminds me of that guy coat commercial with the basketball dude running around <laughs> smacking stuff out of people's hands and saying not today so I thought that was kind of funny somehow I cut this piece of paper wrong because you're not supposed to have a full panel so of uh, you know that covers completely covers your card base so but somehow I did everything seemed to work out though so I don't I don't really know what happened there and kind of putting this all together here's the, where it kind of looks wild that those two purple patterns together but um, this was my favorite card with um, this was my favorite Im favorite images that I colored up I loved coloring that chair and making it look very um, you know shaded and everything and I um, just kind of grounded that chair onto the circle and I'm gonna put the books down to the side and I am going to put my girl sitting over to the right in the chair as if she is waiting for her little kitty cat to come jump up in the space that is beside her but really I wanted you to see a little bit of that shading on that chair which was kind of why I did that but I like to tell the story she's waiting for the the um, her kitty cat to jump up there okay so on this card I am going to use the sentiment because it didn't have a sentiment relax refresh and recharge I'm going to use my Gina K amalgam ink here and get it all inked up and ready to go and then that will do it for me and thank you so much for watching this video I hope you enjoyed it and I'm going to get that glued down and I will catch you in my next video see you later bye